All right, check it out. Just kind of uh, testing a few things here. We have a uh, Canon 5D Mark II on the skier rig. Uh, you can see that the skier uses this follow focus with a silicone band, so it's not um, it's not like a, a lens gear. It's a silicone band, and it, it works it works okay for these EF lenses. I don't know if I'd try it on anything else, but these EF lenses, that, especially the L series, are, are real easy to turn. Um, so anyways, on this rig right now, uh, we're kind of testing it out. Something like this is going to go on a Steadicam. And um, you guys probably saw my obsession with wireless follow focuses uh, recently. And the reason why is because I'm planning on building something um, where the Steadicam operator can move around and we have someone else doing uh, pulling focus wirelessly. And uh, what you'll see is we have the Canon 5D Mark II on this rig. Um, I have my Techion battery pack, which is powering this Asus Ycast uh, HD streaming. Um, I have the uh, Zacuto here just so that the camera operator can frame and uh, so they can see what they're shooting. We have the pass through coming out of the Zacuto back into the Asus and it's streaming video wirelessly to a monitor. And right now we're using uh, my LED uh, monitor and you can see how thin it is up on the side here. It's super, super thin. Um, and so this, this is a 1080 monitor, it's 23 inches. And if you look on the back side here, I'm actually powering this monitor off of another Techion battery pack. That's running on 12 volts. And then I have another one that I switched to five volts to uh, uh, connect to the Asus receiver. So this is receiving the HD wireless from uh, my rig. So again, on this side over here, you look at the monitor and uh, this camera, I'm streaming HD uh, with no latency and some, something like this is going to be okay if you have someone pulling focus remotely. That's kind of why I've been in the market for a wireless uh, follow focus system is so um, hopefully the camera operator can run around and we'll have someone else worry about keeping focus if we're working with a shallow depth of field. So there you go. Handy Techion battery packs. We got three of these here hooked up to the uh, Asus Ycast which is made for the home but um, I'm powering it up here on the rig and we're using the uh, Zacuto EVF to just kind of pass the signal through so that uh, we can still see what we're shooting over here. Cool.